Hello again. I am Mark, and this is Herdsman Foods. I'm making myself laugh today. I'm not sure why. So, welcome to the show. Thank you so much for joining me. I love this time that we get to spend together each week, a couple of times a week. And uh, I appreciate so much uh, the sharing on social media and uh, the likes and the comments and all that thing. So if you could push that like button, I would love that. And if you want to become a subscriber, if you like what you see, be sure to click the subscribe button and also click that little bell icon so that you get notified every time I release a new video. So today we are <laughs> in a realm that I am sort of comfortable with. Um, <laughs> I love olive oil. And uh, these are sardines that are in olive oil. So I love olive oil. I love fish, okay? Not a huge fan of sardines, though. Um, I'm a huge fan of anchovies. Uh, my my uh, brother Tim will tell you uh, I... <laughs> I should like sardines from a story that from when we were in college when I thought I was eating anchovies and actually I was eating uh, sardines, but um, I, I've never t really liked sardines alone. And so I have a friend who uh, I'm, I'm not going to say his name uh, and I, his wife and I'm not going to say her name. Uh, I will tell you that they are kind of um, the Indiana Jones people of business. They are world travelers, and they find the most unique things uh, all over the globe. And he's a huge fan of sardines. And he said to me, these are great sardines. You want some good sardines? We're going to eat some good sardines. They were in, uh, I'm going to say this wrong, Hertz. Herzegovina, Bosnia and Herzegovina. They were over there. And uh, these are from Croatia, though, uh, but they were sold uh, in that area. And uh, they are uh, Adriatic Queen sardines. And so I want to give them a try. I, I always like trying new foods. I love the adventure of life. I love the adventure of trying new things, things that you may not be uh, comfortable with uh, normally. Um, I, you know, we've done a lot of different things on this channel that um, would be, you know, people in America would say, well, why are you, why are you trying that? Why are you eating that? And, and they would try these, some of these things and they would probably go, oh God, how can you like that? Um, we all have such different life experiences and I, I used to be uh, you know, the same way, and I used to go, oh, how could you how could you eat this? You know, when we ate jellyfish or uh, we ate the candied squid and stuff like that, and I would go, oh, how can you like this? But if you grew up with it, you like it. Um, I'm not a fan of collard greens normally, unless they're cooked really well. Uh, yet I have friends in the South that just swear by it. They're just the greatest thing they've ever had. They're comfort food for them. Um, Anchovies. For me, I grew up eating anchovies. I love anchovies, but I have so many people I know that absolutely hate anchovies. So it's really about your experience, your, your life experience. So I just opened these sardines. I'm going to let you take a look here. They're going to they're gonna spill some oil. And uh, I want you to see them, though, because these, <laughs> they are uh, really, really fishy smelling. Uh, the smell when I opened them up, oh my word. I mean, my cats are going to go nuts. When they get this smell, they're going to go nuts. Now, I'm going to do a little something here that most people are going to think is kind of gross. I want to get a little of this olive oil out. I love olive oil. Drink a little of that olive oil. Um, it's good olive oil, I can tell you that. It does taste fishy. Um <laughs> Not, not going to lie there, uh, but what do you expect? What, <laughs> what would you expect olive oil to taste like that was, uh, you know, soaking in the fish? Now, oh boy, this is breaking apart. I'm going to bring it up here so you can see it. Uh, as I grab these little, uh, these little uh, fillets, okay, you can see them there. Um, they're breaking apart, Okay. Um, I wanted a whole flavor. I'm going to try to get an another whole flavor. I'm going to give this a try while I'm doing that. I just love chopsticks. I don't know why. Love eating with chopsticks. Okay. This is a little better. You can see this guy. Oh, yeah. Let's get a thumbnail. Hopefully, that's going to be our thumbnail. 
Man, I'd love that. Look at that guy. <laughs> you can see, you can even see the ridges on its back. Look at that. Oh my word. Mm, the oil dripping off. All right. Okay. Hmm. Really cool. What I love about this is when you eat anchovies, you know you're eating anchovies. Really salty. Because that's how they're prepared. Really salty. <clears throat> um, uh, the texture is very bony. You tend to get bones stuck, little tiny, tiny, tiny little bones. This, uh, and very fishy flavored, right? This is not fishy flavored, which is really cool because I thought it was going to be very fishy uh, flavored. It's a really good taste. Um, I have to say, I have had sardines before out of a can, straight out of a can. And I have not been overly impressed. Now, look at this. I'm going to give another guy here. This is awesome because look at this. You can see, and if I can get the, whoa, Splashola. My cats are going to love this table now. See that little, you can see the, uh, there we go. See the whole body of the fish there. Let me get a better grip here so I can show you guys. But look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? I... <laughs> I'm one of the few people that probably calls that gorgeous. But I'm going to try this again. The olive oil really adds to the flavor. Mmm, so good. I have to say, <clears throat> the fish is... You know, that first one broke, right? But the consistency of the fish is there. It stays together, you know, when you're chewing it. It's a good consistency. It's not oily at all. You know, you would think it's, it's uh, you know, it's, it's preserved in olive oil. It's not an oily flavor. If anything, the texture would make you think it's dry, okay? But it's not dry. It just feels dry. It's a, it's a dry texture. The flavor is outstanding, is outstanding. I would, I would equate the flavor to like a, a, a salmon that is a little bit fit. You know what? Oh, I got it. Perfect. Salmon and eel combined. Okay. If you were to combine the flavors of a salmon and an eel, that's what you're, that's the flavor I'm getting here. And it's a very pleasant fish uh, flavor. I love fish. I love, uh, you know, tuna steaks that are, you know, medium rare and, and, and uh, um, that kind of thing. I love sashimi, uh, you know, raw, raw fish if it's prepared well. This is wonderful. I, I love this. I am actually going to take the oil uh, after I eat these. And I'm going to save that oil to use as a, a oil seasoning. I may, I may put some garlic actually in that oil uh, and let that uh, ferment uh, for a while. Because uh, I think that would be just a great, great flavor. I am so pleasantly surprised by this. I really uh, encourage you, if you can find these, these are uh, Adriatic Queen sardines. So uh, rush out and get some if you can find them anywhere near you. These are made in Croatia. Uh, I looked up the company uh, on on uh, line. And uh, this, this is wonderful. These are great. Guys, thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed this time that we had together. A little different today. We're not doing fast food. We did, uh, did a little, uh, little uh, I guess, maybe fancy food. I, I assume these are pretty expensive, uh, knowing my, my friend and, and his tastes. Um, not, and I shouldn't say it that way because he's also just the opposite of that. Uh, anyway, I'm pretty sure these are expensive, though. Uh, but give them a try. Wow. They are, they are tremendous. Uh, Adriatic Queen sardines in olive oil. Thanks so much for joining me today, guys. I can't appreciate the support for this channel enough. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and share on social media. And once again, remember, don't be afraid to join the herd.